Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at grow-tech.com, and they're talking about Biostrat, a propagation felt. So basically, it's made out of biological materials. I believe this product is made out of hemp. They also have an organic product that is made definitely from hemp, confirmed on their website, but also hemp that is grown without pesticides or herbicides. And that's their pure grown product. We'll show you that in a second. But this is their, you know, their brochure available on their website. I'm going to link to these in the description, of course. They fit perfectly in a 10 by 20 tray. And these are for the home gardeners. They also sell it in big rolls. Now, there's many benefits to this. It's a little bit easier to handle than soil for microgreens. It's great for hydroponic systems, flood and drain, ebb and flow type systems. It doesn't get too moist unless you pool water in it. Also, I've heard that hemp is sort of uh, antimicrobial, so it prevents some fungal buildup on there. It's not perfect, and I'm sure that's why they don't advertise it as such a product. But it has a lot of benefits regardless, because if you're going to grow hydroponically, especially indoors, you don't want to be handling a whole bunch of dirt. Now, they say their thinner product for micro microgreens is compostable in an industrial system. I think that might work in anaerobic digestion when you have a sealed chamber as well, and then you collect the methane, but I'm not sure. Now, I'm going to link to these articles in the description, of course, but this is their page for their pure-grown product, their organic product. They have it in thicker varieties, too, if you want to grow lettuces or greens in a hydroponic system. Now, this is for ebb and flow, flood and drain systems. I wouldn't use this in aeroponics, although I imagine you could use it in aeroponics for a uh, leafy greens and such. You wouldn't want to do it for microgreens, of course. Be overkill. But uh, again, link's in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.